Britain's hospitals and graveyards are making space for the victims of knife crime. But there's another cost to society. Our prisons are filling up with young men who carry the blades. I've been given rare permission to speak to three prisoners who are serving time at Aylesbury Young Offender Institute. Aaron is 20 years old. He's inside for five years for stabbing a passerby during a robbery. Javon is 21. He'll be behind bars for seven years for using a knife. Gavin is 21. He stabbed another boy in a knife fight and will be in prison for three years. My friends carried knives. Um, you know, I, I just felt I just wanted to be part of it. Uh, I didn't know I was. I didn't know what I was going to get myself into. Uh, I certainly didn't know that when uh, I was getting involved in, in knives and I was carrying knives that I would end up in prison. Oh, this is where you're going to end up in, in your life if you, if you carry a knife. And you, you don't have to do anything with it. You get caught with that knife, you, are, you will end up in prison. And, then, and you are you on your own. You are you on your own. Is, you, you, think, you think that they're, they're your friends, but they're not. They're absolutely not. And unfortunately, it's took me to prison then to, you know, to figure that one out. And I guess I, that's the harsh reality of life sometimes. Uh, you know, I, I've, learned, I've learned from that. And hopefully when I get out of prison, you know, I, I want to show other young people you know, that it's not all right to carry a knife. It's, it's, it is not all right. You know, if your friends are doing it, let them do it. You know, don't be part of it. Be, be, who you, be, be yourself. You know, if they don't like you for who you are, then just don't go, don't go there. Just don't go down that road because you will end up where I am, serving a very long sentence. The way I think about stuff now and the way, how I feel about how I, how I affected those people's lives, isn't it? it makes me realise when I see the news, I see bear youths dying just like, what, 27 people died this year? Like, it's just kind of crazy, man. Like, I don't know, all these young youths, they don't got no role models, innit? They're just out there to do, they're out for themselves, innit? They don't care about no one. When you stab someone, you don't think it's going to kill them, innit? You just think, yeah, I'll... I'll I'll stab that guy in the leg or, 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 or just somewhere else and he's going to be all right. He's going to go to hospital. He's going to survive. Get me, he's going to learn. But these days, like, just one little stab wound can end someone's life, you feel what I'm saying? Just like me, I could have got down for an attempt to murder, but because it wasn't as serious as it could have been, to be honest with you, I have to say I got away with it with a GBH, innit? Which I'm grateful and I thank God for and the judge. Because I could have been riding a good 20, 30 years right now. You know what I'm saying? Like one of my codies right now is riding 20 years for, for murder in it, so it's all crazy out there, man. If I didn't come to jail, I wouldn't notice what I've done. I've, I've had a lot of time to think about where I went wrong and what I could have done better, and it's nothing but regrets, man. It's the worst thing that could ever happen to you, like, it takes away everything from you, like, you haven't got nothing. You haven't got no friends in jail. The only thing you've got is, uh, it's, it's hard to explain. Jail's not for animals, it's not for no one. It's not a nice place to be in. It, it, uh, it takes away your life, basically. You're, you're, you're basically dead, but you're still alive in somewhere, like you're away from the world, didn't you? All three men are deeply remorseful. They know if their knives had found a different target, just a few inches would have made the difference between life and death and they would be serving time for murder. At its worst, a stabbing ends in a killing, but there is another tragedy, that of a wasted young life. When you leave prison, do you think you'll ever carry a knife again? Never. 